had like this, this stupid like line of defense. <laughs> Those guys will kind of stress us out, to say the least. But it's okay. I mean, they're really slow. They only move uh, up to point where Magnus is standing right now, so they don't have much uh, action points going on. But I mean, if they do catch up to us, we'll well, they will kill. I mean, those who have uh, HP under 9 will die. I will HP under 10 will die, so... Uh, for example, uh, Alpheus. Yeah, he has HP 8, so he will be dead. And once again, we have to use our uh, Sir here, Magnus, to be able to destroy the greats, or else we'll have an infinite number of waves upon us. That's fun, isn't it? Quite fun, quite fun. So just move everyone up. Not more to do than that. Enemy turn, and here we go. There's a number of greats. A number of sewer openings. Here and there. I don't know why someone would have built in this many sewer openings, but whatever. They are here now, and we have to deal with them. Okay, and there's about, yeah, there's about ten enemies in one room right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah, ex exactly ten. I think, I think if I didn't get that wrong. Anyways, it's not, it's not much of a problem really. These guys are easy, like the, the small creatures are really easy. Uh, they don't take, you know, they don't have much HP going on or anything, so you take them out easily. But what's hard right now is to actually think out a strat strategic way to take out, I mean, secure the grates and also to take, take out that uh, green wave behind us. Yes, <laughs> they're not doing it too much easier for us. It's kind of stressful. Still, they are slow, but we have to move fastly to actually be able to secure all the grates and so still be able to, uh, how to say, uh, how to say, take out those uh, green guys behind us. So yeah, um, oh, and also, uh, what's it called? Uh, what was I gonna say? I, I forgot what I was gonna say. Yeah, I totally forgot. Ah, oh, never mind. Ah, never mind. Oh, wow, that was, that was weird. Okay, enemy turn. Ah yeah, I, I was gonna say it's it's quite it's quite uh, it's quite risky to actually split up on the group like this, like the way I'm gonna do now. Just because uh, you know, if if they're alone and they get attacked, there's no one to back them up, like put in a defensive stance or anything. So you, they just have to take damage. But I think they still handled it pr pretty fairly easily, pretty good. They didn't die, so. I guess that's that's great, you know. They didn't die. I guess that's minimum requirements, though, for us, of course. We have to have the best in the world. I don't know what these guys are doing. They're like moving behind cover, I think, because they know that. I think they know that I have the Delius, and he's gonna just one shot kill everything. I mean, every thing on this map. The Delius is crazy. Like the the, the, the ranged. The, uh, it's just so overpowered. He's definitely a great sniper, though he can't do much in one round because it, because of the ape action points the the gun consumes. It's two, and that's that's a lot of action points for a gun to consume. Like one, that's 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 a lot, but two, wow. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. Put him in a defensive stance. Take the Idealist. Oh yeah, I remember what I did here now. So we have to find a sort of a strategic way to actually make them turn their back against us. So I thought, yeah, I used the Idealist as bait, <laughs> and I use uh, our Sir over there as uh, Killer Magnus, so that he will be the executioner. And if that even goes wrong, I have Alpius over at the top there. Uh, he will be able to take out. Whatever is left of the enemies, if something would go wrong. Well, so this room is now secured, really. Uh, oh no, not yet, actually. We still need to get Belinius down to that uh, lower left corner. 
so that you can secure that crate. And then, then it'll be just waiting game again. Ugh. Just a waiting game. And now we, that thing is gonna die. Ah, so easy, so easy. 18 times 3 damage. That's uh, like 16, 24, yeah. Easy peasy, easy peasy. Do you wanna die too? Oh, here you go, no problem. No problem, I mean, you, you can all die, you don't have to... You don't have to shove. I think my gun's gonna get overheated now. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, come on, yeah, it's gonna get overheated now. But it, but it won't break, it's just, just gonna get overheated. Yeah, there we go. But it stopped shooting after all that. So... Keep moving our way down here. Keep getting closer to our goal. I do want to get those crates. I mean, not the, those crates, but uh, did not have the time to do that, I guess. And now we have even Celsius helping us out with these green guys. And as you see, like I mean, <laughs> I was a bit stressed at first, but really they're they're not they're not fast at all. So they're really really super slow. <laughs> I can do a lot during one round without them even bothering me at all. Oh, there we go, and he needs to just move forward. Just end the round. There we go. Uh huh. They come out there. Oh, he will be shot from all the way over there. And there you see, it takes 11 damage. 11 damage, one shot from the auto cannon. It's crazy, man. Like, why does it shoot three times then? If it takes 11 damage, why shoot three times? Like. It's crazy, you, you don't need that much of a power going on. Like, I thought the sniper rifle was overpowered, but really now. Alright. Well, th those guys can still try to come in, but they, won't, they don't pose much of, much of a threat, so... And here we go, this this shall be soon the moment of truth. Two more rounds left and then we, then we'll see what happens. And you know those green guys, they move exactly two tiles. They have exactly two action points, so that's that's super slow, yeah. And they move only two tiles, so not too hard to handle, really. And now we can move into position and secure the area, even here, without using am ammunition. And that is truly securing the area. I wouldn't use Magnus to actually run up there and uh, close up that lid on that thing, but the problem is that we have we have those guys coming in, so I couldn't really I couldn't really put them over there yet. We'll soon, though. We'll soon. All right, so go take that long shot, and yeah, I did miss that one. I mean, come on now. <laughs> Like when I saw that one, I was like, "Wow, he really can reach all the way there!" Like th it's a possibility to actually be able to shoot all the way over there. And I was like, "Wow, okay, that's too overpowered." But no, he did miss that. And I mean, come on now, it, it should be like one percent chance I should be able to hit that far. Like, I felt like, man, come on, it, it's so unfair to be able to shoot them all the way over there. But he did miss, so it is all good. And now these green guys are getting quite. Wait, close up here. So we move them two tiles away from them, and they will not be able to attack us. No, two tiles away. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Okay, yeah, I, I chose to put Celsius in the in the action center. Instead, I used him to take out our nemesis over there and put him in that spot right there. There we go. Exactly. And uh, do you want to shoot him? Nah. Do you? Nah. Good. Just put yourself in defensive position. Just do it. Just do it. There we go. Like, do you want? I don't know. I don't. I don't remember really too much of what I did. I know just that it was a good waiting game. Like, um, uh, yeah. <laughs> you'll you'll see later. Like, you'll see later what troubles we had to go through. Wow. Uh, the next level, man. You. <laughs> And it'll be soon coming through, so put yourself in defensive position. Do it! Defensive position, that's the only way to go. 
stupid me in the past.